Hey guys, Scrub Lord here, and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this episode, we're going to be taking a look at Magic versus No Magic in Neo. Overall, I think Neo is an excellent game uh, made by Team Ninja. It's much like a Souls game, and a lot of Souls fans will really like it. But they put a lot of broken mechanics into the game to make it much, much easier. In this segment here, I'm just cheesing things up. I'm casting every spell. I'm going to show you how to just completely cheese the boss and make it not very difficult. Ishidu Mitsunari is actually one of the more difficult bosses in the game, but he doesn't have to be. You can just cast a bunch of spells. Uh, you nerf him, you buff yourself, you use magic, ninjutsu, living weapon, and just fucking wreck the dude. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm all for wrecking the boss, but you know, sometimes it's just a little bit too easy. But hey, no one's forcing you to cheese the boss. You can avoid the magic, the ninjutsu, and the living weapon, and just kill it regular. I'll show you how. Now, I don't intend for this to be some sort of damning critique on Neo, but it is a critique nonetheless. Here you see my scrub cred kind of showing its true colors. I'm still practicing the key pulse, and I'm almost at the end of the game. But here you see a character who's about 30 levels under-recommended. That's not necessarily a bad thing. You should be able to take these things out. But I'm refusing to use any magic, ninjutsu, or even my living weapon other than for the passive benefits. And I go ahead and buff my weapon. But other than that, this is just a straight-up fight. It was better, wasn't it? I, I mean, you just fought him the way you felt like you were supposed to fight him, and you got through the fight. So, I feel like in order to get the most out of Neo, you kind of have to voluntarily nerf yourself. You have to fight the bosses without taking advantage of all of the crazy mechanics that are so OP, and Neo will actually be a really fun game. The problem I have with those OP mechanics is once you kind of break down and start using them, anytime you get stuck, you just go straight for the OP mechanics. And it, in my opinion, personally, it kind of ruins the game. So anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, leave a like and subscribe and check back. I might do some more Neo videos. I will definitely be back on Dark Souls 3 at the end of the month.